Welcome back. Well, it's been so uplifting seeing so many UK athletes donating their time, energy, and sometimes even their NIL money to help Eastern Kentucky flood victims. Both basketball teams at the telethon, the football team at Father Jim Sitchko's house, and now the volleyball team is in Breathitt County. LAX 18's Megan Mannering has tonight's Big Blue Story presented by CHI St. Joseph Health. Two weeks out from UK Volleyball's home opener, and today the preseason conditioning looks and sounds more spiritual than sport. Well, we just felt the best way we could help is by being here, you know, and, and getting in the bus and coming down. Donations are steadily flowing, supplies arriving nearly every hour, but manual labor is in short supply for those in flood recovery mode. And obviously, like we're a team, we put our mind to something that we're going to get it done. So we're in there organizing super fast. We're, you know, working out all summer so we can carry all the heavy boxes and stuff, which is super great because I know a lot of these people um, right now can't do that. So taking it out to their cars, anything that we can do to help, honestly, just to make the operation a little bit more smoother while we're here. Stacking the supplies that's now piling up at the First Church of God, the UK volleyball team has a special connection to this area. It's like we host camps in the summer and a lot of the Breathitt County like came to our camp, so we knew some of the girls. So the fact that they're going through this hardship right now, it means a lot that we can come down and help them out. Spending the day off the court goes a long way. That is so wonderful because you don't see the youth anymore doing that, you know, and I think it's showing like the impact on people's hearts and their compassion for people. Today, the assignment is sacrifice. They're getting reps of relief because when the last whistle blows, that's what matters. Well, we've always recruited to try and win championships and be the best, but we've also want to be a program that has a bigger purpose and the bigger purpose uh, this year is to help the people of Eastern Kentucky and um, do what we can to um, you know, help our players understand, our new players understand that life is way bigger than a game. In Breathitt County, Megan Mannering, BBN Tonight. All right, thanks, Megan. Former UK basketball player Dominique Hawkins is doing his part as well. BBN Tonight, it's Michael Burke spent the day with Dom at his basketball camp. You can go whenever you want to. When he needed guidance on what to do in the present moment, former UK guard Dominique Hawkins Look to Kentucky's past. I know the catalog list of the Kentucky players and how big and respected they are. And I feel like they helped out whenever Kentucky was in a bad situation. And right now it's a very bad situation in eastern Kentucky where historic flooding uprooted so many homes and lives. Dominique, who grew up in Madison County, wanted to help out in some way. Basically getting the little ones in the gym. And I know school is coming up soon, so it's almost the last uh, few days of summer and just trying to have fun with them. Cost is $100 to secure a spot in one of the two camp sessions running today and tomorrow, and it's money very well spent. To go to Hawkins camp tomorrow, if your child wants to go, drop by the Madison Central High School gym between 7.30 and 9 a.m. to register. Camp tips off at 9, runs until 11.30, and it's $100, as he said. More BBN Tonight is right after this.